Hey everyone, Mark from Guitar Nerds here to tell you about a brand new innovation in renting out the coolest guitar gear. Since the explosion of the internet in the early 2000s, people have been looking for ways to share what they own with others. These days, you wouldn't think of traveling to another city without checking out your Airbnb options or getting home at night without searching for an Uber. But no one has cracked the crowd sharing formula for musical instruments until now. Fretish.com is a new site that is aiming to become your home for renting out guitar gear. Started in Boston, most of the gear currently listed is in the New England area, but it's growing fast and exciting gear is popping up all over the world. In fact, we've just listed a huge amount of Guitar Nerds approved gear on the site available to rent in the UK. So how does it work? Well, there's no cost to join Fretish and there's no additional cost to post an instrument for rent. And unlike Craigslist, you don't have to repost an instrument every 30 days for it to stay live on the site. You set the price for renting your instrument and you set any dates when your instrument is not available for rent. Perfect for regular gigging musicians who want to make some money when they're not on the road. How does Fretish make money? All transactions made through the site have an 11% processing fee, similar to how a consignment shop works. So if you're looking for a brand new pedal but can't make it down to a retail store to try before you buy, why not consider looking on Fretish for one to rent close to you? This gives you the opportunity to try it with your rig in your home, all for as little as $1 a night. Honestly, Fretish looks like a fantastic service and opens the possibility of renting out that vintage Les Paul Jr. for that tricky recording session directly from another musician, bypassing expensive equipment rental companies. For touring musicians, it seems like the ideal way to make some money from your gear when you're back at home. Initial impressions show that the range of gear listed is growing all the time, and as more people sign up, I'm sure some rare and interesting gear will pop up. So what do you think? Would you put your gear up for hire on Fretish? What have you seen on the site that you want to hire? Check it out at fretish.com and let me know in the comments below. Thanks very much. We'll see you next time.